Okay, well we did it. We installed the entire Jeff Motors turbo kit in one day, uh, which was only about six hours actually. It was pretty easy. And uh, then we spent the next day tuning, uh, which was also pretty easy. We toyed with different spring rates. We tried the stock, we tried a red, we tried a yellow. Red's sort of medium, yellow's pretty stiff. Uh, we also played with different dash pot oils in the uh, carburetor. Uh, we ended up going with very thick oil. And so in the end, yesterday we finished tuning it. Uh, we ended up with a red spring, 10 and a half ounces. Uh, Reprofiled the BFM needle, started out with the BFM needle, and then we just kept measuring from the top to the bottom where it was rich, where it was lean. Uh, we do have a tailpipe O2 sniffer that we stuck in the tailpipe and we could drive it and look at it. And, and we finally got it there. You know, it was, uh, again, pretty easy. It's not that hard. Uh, but anyway, we ended up with a profiled needle custom. Uh, we ended up with a red spring and 90 weight dash pot oil. Uh, we started toying with the different uh, boost pressures and uh, also the pop-off. So I think we've got it dialed. I mean, here it is. We've got a one-to-one -one rising rate fuel pressure regulator. We've got our fuel pressure set at about three and a half PSI at uh, on, not on boost. When we do get on boost, this vacuum port right here starts blowing into this valve and it starts feeding more fuel pressure to it. Um, and then, of course, we've got the GT15 turbo with the K&N air filter. Uh, we ran the oil drain off of the bottom of the turbo over to the back of the block where the fuel pump or the mechanical fuel pump would be because on this three synchro, four speed, 850 Moke gearbox, there is no flywheel housing breather, which would have been just a short little drop from there to there. So anyway, we had to do a few more custom little things because this is a mini Moke. It's a turbocharged Mini Moke. We kind of nicknamed it the Toke. Turbo Moke. Toke. How high are you? Hi, how are you? No, I said, how high are you? Hi, how are you? So anyway, there it is. Tomorrow, we're rolling it on the dyno. Today, we just drove it up on there, set the stands, chalked it, said, okay, this will work great. So tomorrow's dyno tuning day, and uh, let's see what we roll. Stay tuned.